assists and only nine turnovers. Great ball movement that led to us playing with pace not only in the open floor, but as well to the half court, guys. Morris, Beal, Kispert in the starting lineup for Porzingis, Kuzma, and Daniel Gafford. Meanwhile, for the Sacramento Kings, as you see Keegan Murray's floater goes down. Edwards is going to have the assignment of trying to stop and lock down Bradley Beal. He is their defensive stopper and definitely is taking on that role for the Kings. For all big boy post work, I mean footwork, immaculate footwork. This guy, left hand, right hand, he is a beast. And Suyesh Mehta in his third year, he was born in Baltimore. He went to Centennial High School in Ellicott, Maryland, also a University of Maryland alum. Hands it off to Beal. Beal being guarded by Kessler Edwards. Brad misses. There's De'Aaron Fox. Nice feed inside to Harrison Barnes, who finds the bonus. Good ball movement as he gets the Wizards off their feet as he scores. And you see he is a bulldozer. They've hit their first three three-pointers tonight. They've got a 13-9 advantage. Sabonis again off glass. You have to be mindful of that left hand, Drew, and he is a brute force type player when he gets down I mean, low. Do rear night, huh? He should. We talked about it. you got to score with this team, and Washington's doing that so far. Sabonis misses that three. Keegan Murray shoots over Beal, air balls it. Kisper <sighs> passed it right to Edwards, upstairs to Sabonis. And that is a no-no right there. Here's Sabonis on a post up. Out to Keegan Murray for another three-point opportunity, and he knocks it down. Here's Kuz, five on the shot clock, trying to hit that sweet spot, which has been so helpful for the Wizards early in this game. That's the first miss. Here's Kuz, five on the shot clock, trying to hit that sweet spot, which has been so helpful for the Wizards early in this game. That's the first miss from three tonight for Washington. Davis triggers a jump. Yeah, this is what they do. Here's Davis again for three. And here come the Sacramento Kings as they retake the lead. Now. Monk is instant offense off the pine. Nice dump off inside to Sabonis. And that's where they hurt you. And they hit the half court set, middle pick and roll with Sabonis. <laughs> <laughs> Here's Monk. Misses Sabonis there with the tip in. <laughs> Here's Monk. Misses Sabonis there with the tip in. Kuz with 19 on a bad leg, but they got to get back on defense as Sabonis rocks the rim. Yeah, they're gonna they're gonna have to do something with Sabonis, but not too much on that roll. The defense there by Gafford. Gafford with two fouls. Wow. Sabonis just muscles his way in. There's nothing you can do with that. You're getting a steady diet of paint and threes with this number one offense in the NBA. Well, and then you add the fast break points. They have nine of those. Daniel Gafford goes to the cup getting the end one. Then all of a sudden he comes to Sacramento this year and they have a high powered offense. Absolutely. And, you know, we were joking early on. Oh. I could, if I shot a three when I was playing for Mike Brown, I was coming out the game and <laughs> make a miss. And I'm getting jealous right now because I'm seeing 17 three-pointer shot. This is under two minutes. I said, Mike, uh, Drew wanted me to ask you if you would have took a three. Why didn't you let him shoot in 2007 during the finals? And Nowitzki and Michael Finley and all those guys. Sabonis shooting the first of two. That is not the case. They're currently two of eight. But they get to the foul line, and that's even more impressive when you talk about this offensive juggernaut they are. And guess what? They also shoot a high clip, a high percentage. They're not just hoisting up shots. They're making them. Here's Monte getting into the paint. That's blocked by Sabonis. Kyle Kuzma averages 21 points per game. If he makes this free throw, he's already hit his average as he misses. Daniel Gafford gets the ball. Tried to score over two Kings. They're going to call a foul on Sacramento. Another minus 20. Here's a kick out to Harrison Barnes. That has been a hot spot on the floor for both teams tonight. Missing. Here's Fox stepping into a three. Fade away. Aaron Fox with another jumper. 
Sabonis with a handoff to Kessler Edwards who tries his hand at a three. Chris Miller, Drew Gooden, Megan McPeak with you here on a Saturday night. Beal out to Kispert. That rattles out. Rebound Sabonis. You're dealing with a different type of animal in Sabonis. He's not your ordinary center where you can sag off on him, trot back and forth down the court, bump him every once in a while. And if he's trying to pop out to those wings and those uh, the mid post, you got to get out of full out denial in front of him, calling out the whites, making guys rotate. They're going to just blow you up and just plow, uh, plow right over you. Sabonis had a triple double against the Wizards back on December the 23rd. Demona Sabonis now with 22 points. Now, Megan, thank you. Hey, there was some heat out there for sure. Davion Mitchell skirt. Misses. Good box out by Anthony Gill, but Sabonis is still able to clean up that. Davion Mitchell skirt. Misses. Good box out by Anthony Gill, but Sabonis is still able to clean up that offensive rebound. Do that. They need to guard the three point line as Monk goes baseline. Another good defensive effort by Gill, but the pass right to Sabonis. And that's twice tonight the Wizards have saved the ball. They're going to do that. They need to guard the three point line as Monk goes baseline. Another good defensive effort by Gill, but the pass right to Sabonis. And that's twice tonight the Wizards have saved the ball to alleviate those those mental problems and have you have them play for you. There's a miss there by Sabonis as Daniel Gafford's back into the game showing some resistance. Denny is struggling from the field one of eight. This guy ain't struggling coming off the bench Malik Monk with the three. Yeah I mean you have to do your work early. Sabonis. Monk again. I think Diddy was caught in no man's land. He had to make a decision. Was he going to guard Monk or the corner? And when I talk about the confidence through a, throughout the group, for example, they were down 10 points in the first half of this game. Earlier today. Well, I was saying that. You know, Malik Monk is from Arkansas. Yeah, yeah I got you. Damana Sabonis, 8 of 10 from the free throw line. They get 9 of 11. Bonus makes both. 